Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Mobile Freak, and today we'll compare these two devices. One on the left side is Poco M3, and one on the right side is Xiaomi Mi 10T, you know, which is much stronger device. But we are here to test the speed between them. Of course, Xiaomi Mi 10T will really clean this M3, but you know. We're doing this test just for, you know, uh, fun and just to see uh, how much you will get if you pay for this M3 or how much you will get if you pay for this Mi 10T or this M3, you know, in terms of speed. And uh, let's see, like I show you already, everything is closed in the background and let's quickly turn them off and after that we will turn them on at the same time and we will see for how much is faster this Mi 10T, you know. So let's give them some time so they are fully turned off and for, you know, when we're waiting, just click the subscribe button because we need to hit that 9K, that's the goal right now, and we can start this boot up test right now. They are turned on at the same time and faster one will be meat and tea, but still, let's see and give this M3 some chance. Okay, meat and tea, really, really fast, but this M3 is not that far behind. Let's unlock them and give them some time so they are fully ready to ready to go and we will do this test without any problems and the we can start it right now i show you that everything is closed in the background and we can start with phone dialer much faster messages I would say just is uh, this Mi 10T much faster or it's uh, not much faster compared to this M3, you know, because all time it will be faster, you know, if, and if that is not case, then there is some, you know, problem at that time, but all time it will be like on M3, on Mi 10T, you know, because it's a lot, lot more powerful device. A lot faster. Let's go with YouTube, which is here. Not that faster, just good amount, but not that faster. Let's go with Facebook. Much faster. Let's go with WhatsApp. Really close. Viber. Pretty close, I will say. Instagram. Same. Wish. It's not the same time, but it's same like pretty close and same for this wish really close let's go with snapchat Snapchat is uh, all these apps are you know they will be pretty close because they are not that hard to open but when it comes to the games they will be a really really uh, big difference so let's go with jetpack like in this jetpack you will see right now you know this one in even open the game this one didn't start the loading we'll just turn off the sound and you can see a lot faster when this start to game, you know, but when we only using a normal device, there will not be that much of the difference. Sometimes it will be because, you know, this uh, chip device can do great, but sometimes they just, you know, stop and they are doing not that well, but other times they are just enough great to use like a normal device, you know, because it's a normal device. And Meet and T, this time, I would say a lot faster, yeah, a lot faster, but still M3 is not that bad. Let's go with Angry Birds 2. This time, you know, pretty, pretty fast on this meat and tea. Huge difference right now in this Angry Birds 2. A 
and let's go back to home screen. We have subway surface, right? Now let's go, man. And look at this. That's the the difference between them in terms of speed. You know, when you tap that, it's instant. But when you tap on this one, it like closing really slow. It's like running and just, you know, normal walking. Look at this. And then he, he goes to home screen. Let's go with Temple Run 2. And sometimes I will misclick, you know, I will not click at the same time. But in this case, it's not even, you know, need to be at the same time. It's really, really big difference, you know. But let's see. And this, you know, uh, phone is really, really for gaming. This is like if you really want to buy something which is brutal for gaming, this one is the will be your choice, trust me. But if you need a really, really strong battery and don't care for that performance, this one is best overall, you know, 6,000 mAh, uh, you know, hours of battery. What was that, guys? So let's go with Geekbench 5. To see the real difference between them in terms of CPU benchmark score and let's run at the same time and we will back up to this test and finish. So these are the results between these two devices and it's a really really big gap gap between you know them but still you need to choose what you need. They are both Android 10 and this is 6 gigabits compared to 4 gigabits of M3 M3 sorry. Let's go with speed test uh, by Okla and see the difference between them in terms of internet, you know, download and upload speed. And they are of course on the same Wi-Fi network, so there, there is no difference at all. Let's see what this M M3 can do does, you know. Three, two, one. And go. Much better on this meat and tea. And in terms of uploading, it's the same case. They are pretty much the same when the upload uh, speed goes up. Zetch. Much faster on mid than T. Let's go back, and the last step is color switch, which is faster on mid and T. So the case here is not to say the M3 is not a good phone or something like that, but the case here is just to see what is the difference between this around 150 uh, euros or in my in my country 180 euros phone compared to this 400 phone from Xiaomi they are both from Xiaomi you know they are Xiaomi so these are the difference in terms of speed uh, we are here only because of speed there is a lot of more difference between them in terms of screen uh, you know screen size uh, battery uh, fast, faster charging speed, you know, um, storage, uh, RAM memory, you know, cameras, everything is really, really different, but we are here just because of speed test, and that's really much faster on this mid and T, but this M3 is still really usable without any problems, you can even play the games, but don't expect too much. So that's pretty much it. If you're new to the channel, sub will be really amazing. We, we are here to hit that 9k and we will see you in the next video. Peace!